Is that a halo? Yep, I think it is. Oh, and then you got this. It's so bright I can't even look. But, oh there it is. Breathe in the heavy metals. Oh well, it's probably saving us from exploding with the sun's, from the sun's radiation and our radiation coming together. I'm telling you, that's still my theory. That's the only thing it could be. Why the hell else would they be spraying us with heavy metals? I mean, besides to control our minds. But they could do that without the heavy metals. So they do that with the tell lies to your vision. The television. Yeah. So, hmm. You think our radiation doesn't mix with sun's radiation and so they are shielding us with heavy metals in the sky causing halos and because it's always around the sun at sunset it's always on the sun at sunrise it's always on the moon I wonder if, I don't know there it has I mean because these people breathe in this shit too the people that are spraying it so it has to be something that's catastrophic the reason they'd be doing it right yeah. Unless they're just fucking idiots. I don't know. So I used to be a bartender. I worked with this cool chick from Los Angeles named Megan. And this other cool chick named Lisa from Drain, Oregon. And we used, Megan told us, Budweiser stood for, because you deserve what every individual should enjoy regularly. It's the king of beers. And so that's what we would say to our customers. And we would get lots of tips for that one. Yeah. Anyways, I thought that was a little fun fact because you deserve what every individual should enjoy regularly. Not sponsored by Budweiser. <laughs> what is it? He's so tired. He's like, I want to play. You want to play? You want to play? there's a mess we're building oh yeah so me and my daughter decided because we're getting rid of the pool and we got to replant we we're just going to try to make the yard better so we planted these little sunflowers we just threw some sunflowers down is what we did we didn't like plant it but see me and they go all the way around and hi and anyways we're going to make a little sunflower house it's going to be great I'll let you know how it turned out. Whoa, let's get brighter now, the halo. Hmm, I haven't seen one of those in a minute. Maybe it's our passed on loved ones all getting together and singing. I have a crazy story about a halo. My daughter told me after my, my husband died. She said, Mom, Dad, Dad has his wings, but he doesn't have that thing on his head yet. Holy crap. I freaked out. I'm like, what? You gotta be kidding me. Anyways, a few days later, I met this lady that made cards. Handmade, like, she painted and handmade cards and did art. And, hey, hey, shush, 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 be quiet, hey guys, oh my gosh, they're not listening, anyway, this lady, she said, come here, come here to me, and she told me to grab this card off of her table, and I grabbed it, and she said, now read it. Holy shit. It said, I'm not kidding you, an angel in his glory. Then the lady looked at me right in my eyes and she goes, look, he has his halo. That's not a God thing. 
I don't know what is. Come on. That was like, I needed that at that time. Yep. Big guy always comes through when you need him. All glory to the most high God. Because we all, none of us would even be here, you know? It wouldn't even be a thought. Anyways, that's a little um, God testimony right there. Yeah, maybe a church would be cool where we did that, you know, gave testimony and didn't get another person's interpretation of the Bible. Just meet up, give testimony, you know, how God worked in your life that day, that week. That month depends on how often you want to show up, right? Dance a little, sing a little, maybe have some refreshments, who knows? I think that'd be a way cooler, better way to praise. Just my opinion. Anyways. TTYL. Is that talk to you later? Yeah. <laughs> oh, jeez. <sighs> oh, yeah, one last thing. Um. We're taking the pool part out. Yeah. And the rest, like, the, you know, the, the frame of the pool, that part is going to be, like, it's going to be the guide that, like, you know, that holds the, the sunflowers up so they don't tip over and so that it'll make a room, you know? Does that make sense? Anyways, hopefully it'll work out and it'll look so cool because I think that little cowboy over there, that one right next to that little bird thing, yeah, he's going to love this sunflower house. Yeah, he's our muscle. 